November the 10th, walk without stumbling. Taken from Psalm 121 verse 3, he will not suffer thy foot to be moved. Psalm 121 is a psalm that my mom used to teach me all the time. I would look my eyes up into the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord in heaven and earth. He will not suffer thy foot to be moved. If the Lord will not suffer it, writes Charles Spurgeon, neither men nor devils can do it. Oh, how they will gloat, isn't it? They will rejoice with our fall. They will drive us out of any position that we hold. They will bury us in memory. But it will not happen as long as the Lord does not suffer it. They could do this to their heart's content. If it were not for one hindrance and only one, the Lord will not suffer it. And if the Lord does not suffer it, we will not suffer it. Isn't that wonderful? What a blessing. And so he who is able to keep himself upright and to walk without stumbling throughout life has the best of reasons for gratitude. What with pitfalls and snares and weak knees and weary feet, and subtle enemies, no child of God would stand fast for an hour if it were not for the faithful love that will not suffer his foot to be moved. Amidst a thousand snares I stand, upheld and guarded by thy hand, that hand unseen shall hold me still and lead me to thy holy hill. Amen and amen.